we're gonna go ahead and dive into part two. Um, that's a nice switch up. I feel like it's a, I feel like it's different from the first half of the album. I liked it. I liked it. Y'all gonna be like, you're a yes man, dude. Like you haven't said nothing bad about the album, bro. I like the album. Get off me. We gonna hop into Puppet. I'm your puppet. Sonic, you've been trying to find your way to me. That was Puppet. Um, I know that because I don't, I'm probably gonna like post it somewhere, somewhere like right around like the screen or whatever. Um, but Tyler had made a post and was like, This isn't Bastard, this isn't Goblin, this isn't Wolf, this isn't Cherry Bomb, this isn't Flower Boy. The, you have to experience this your own, like separately like don't go in here thinking about his previous projects but i have to say that puppet really how can i say it like it don't it doesn't it doesn't sound like anything off of the wolf album but it it makes me feel like the songs off of the wolf album made me feel does that make sense let me shut my ass up this is uh what's good Oh, I love, I love that. Dracula, Dracula, Dracula. Oh my Suck me fresh on my dick back and shouldn't take me. Green hair, angels all around me. Ah. I reset everything I deliver, especially like you said. Let me just, let me just say, you, if Ty Tyler, by any chance, if you see this, You did not need to go off that hard. <laughs> you did not. Oh my goodness. I don't even know if I don't even know if I can handle it anymore, bro. Like that was what's good. Oh my god. Bro, give me a second, bro. Goodness gracious. This dude really went crazy. Okay, this is Gone Gone, Thank You, Thank You. It's a six-minute song. I'm pretty sure it's, a, it's like two songs in one. Wait, wait. Before we even get into thank you or... You going you going crazy or what you whatever you about to do. Gone gone is like I'm seeing like I'm seeing so many things with that song, bro. Like I can see a video with it. I can see it being in a movie, bro. Like cuz it's like one of those Tyler songs that's like it can be happy go lucky on the surface or you could make it really dark or you could make it you know, have like its own little undertones. It could have double meanings. That's kind of what that song is. Cause like, yeah, the beat's happy go lucky, but I mean, he's at the end of the day, he's still saying my love's gone. Like, you can still make it. I don't know. I don't know. That's just how I took it. I got nothing but memories. I know your secrets, nigga. I'm not bitter. <laughs> in my eyes bro and tell me that these beats are not fire i'm right here i'm right here tell tell me the beats aren't fire tell me besides cherry bomb i don't like cherry bomb so you can have that if you think there's some beats on there aren't fire or whatever but like tell me something that that tyler does that the beats aren't fire even when even on bastard where he like his production wasn't as polished as it is right now bro tell me tell me one tyler beat just one i just need one that's not fire bro stop it that was gone gone thank you i could i could just let that ride bro and just like have it in the background or i could like bro on a drive bro that's six minutes of fire bro like thank you just sounds like just just i think it's just a beat i don't think he rapped on that beat 
So that was fire. Now we on I Don't Love You Anymore. Not even a three minute song, but still fire to your boy. Are we still friends? That is Igor, y'all, by Tyler the Creator. Um, honestly, how I feel about this album is, I feel like this isn't the album that if you just like basically what I'm doing, like if you got headphones and you sitting down. I don't feel like that is how this album is supposed to be into like ingested. Like even he said it like he ride around or ride his bike or whatever while he's listening to. It. This like his album. I feel like this is like really a vibey album. I like the album. Don't get me wrong. I think the album is fire. Um, I think the album is fire, but I feel like overall just chill, like and chill and like vibe on it. Like don't come on here. Like he said, like I think everything he said about it is one hundred percent facts. Like don't come on here thinking that you're gonna get you know this from Wolf or this from Flower Boy or this from Bastard or this from Goblin. You're not gonna get that. Like, try like, and just take it as its own thing and vibe. Like, because on on some of Tyler's more calm songs, you really can vibe them out. Like, you can really vibe them out when he's not smacking you to death with bars. You can really like, he has that ability where he like goes crazy on bars, but he still, you can still just vibe out. Like, bro. The first half of this thing, I feel like it was beat heavy. You know, I feel like it was dope, but I feel like the last half is really where like it really shines with the with the with the vibiness. The whole album, top to bottom, is dope. Whatever you like, there's something on here for it. Like, as far as if you're a Tyler fan and you like, oh, I want bars. There's some bars on here. Oh, well, I want vibe. There is a vibe. The whole album is a vibe. So that's my opinion, y'all. Y'all know I'm not going. I'm not gonna react on something I just don't like. Like I'm just, I'm. It's just not gonna happen. You're not gonna see me out here bashing some artist's album. It's just not gonna happen. This album was fire to me. If y'all liked it, smash that like button for me. Subscribe, ring that notification bell so y'all can know when I upload. It, it really helps. It really does. And um, probably in the next couple days, depending on how I'm gonna do this upload system with the like, I've never done an album reaction, album review. I don't know how this is gonna get set up, but um. Um, the next thing I got going, if y'all can see it right here, is uh, Fever. Fever by um, by my boo, Make the Stallion. So uh, that's it for the video, y'all, and I'll catch you guys next time. Yeah, yeah.